Hi, this is Angie at Polish Picture. In this short video, I'm going to show you how I use Auto Loader in my workflow. So at this point in time, I have loaded all my photos. I've adjusted them all for white balance and exposure if I've needed to, and they're all exported into a folder on my desktop with the client's last name. So right now, what I my next step is to work through all of these images in Photoshop. And like I mentioned before, Auto Loader is an integral part of that process. So I am going to first pull up my auto loader panel to tell it where all my files are located and where I want them saved. So in this, in this case, all the photos from my session are in the Smith folder. There's only four. Obviously, there would be more, but this is just for demonstration purposes. Um, I'm going to tell it every time it opens a photo to run my workflow action on it. And then I'm going to tell it to save it back on my desktop in my Smith Finals folder. So I always name it like the client's last name and the word finals. And I'm going to tell it to save it as a JPEG level 10. So it's all set and ready to go. So all I need to do is hit my shortcut key and it's opened my first image and it's run in action. And so I'm going to get in here and I'm going to, you know, edit my photo. I won't bore you with all these details. That looks horrible, but anyways, um, let's say I'm done editing my photo. I just hit my shortcut again, and it's saving it as a JPEG level 10 in the folder where I told it, so it's saving it in my finals folder, and it opens my next image to edit and runs the action. So again, you know, I'll come in here and do whatever edits I want to do. Um, obviously, I do more editing normally, and then I, when I'm done, hit my shortcut key, save that one as a JPEG level 10, open the next one, runs my action. You can see how many steps this takes um, takes care of that I don't have to manually do. Um, and I think that's about it. If you have any questions on how to use it or how I use it, I'd be happy to try and help. Um, and I appreciate you watching my video. Thank you.